Hi besties, welcome back. In today's video, I'm gonna be removing these shelves that I've had here for a long time already, but I was just kind of not liking it anymore. I couldn't figure out how to decorate them. So I decided with my new corbels that I purchased from Home Goods that I would cut a piece of wood and make a shelf from that. So I'm gonna be doing that. And you guys, I know it's a little bit early for fall, but I had all of this decor that I showed you guys in the hall of like Home Goods and Hobby Lobby laying around. So I decided to use that decor to decorate this little area. And I really enjoy and love the way it looks right now. I'm going to leave it up, but the fall videos will be coming soon. Since we're going to be in August in a couple of days, I'm really excited for all of the fall decor. At the end of the video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I decorated just a little bit, you guys, for 4th of July, like my patriotic decor. I didn't really make any videos um, showing you guys my home tour or anything besides maybe one video of how I decorated. Um, I think it was like the shelves around my um, fireplace. But I want to show you guys the little decor I did put up. It's nothing, <laughs> nothing um, like fancy or anything like that. But I still wanted to share it with you guys before I take it all down. I showed you guys these bookends that I purchased over at Home Goods. They were $9.99 each, so I decided that I wanted to use them as corbels. So I'm going to be using this Dremel tool right here just to kind of um, make the same size of that little keyhole um, hanger on the back. I'm just kind of shaving it down and then I'm going to add an attachment to kind of sand it down as well to make it a little bit more smooth um, because you can see right here that it's making it like look like it has lines right here but once i sand it down with that other attachment it just made it all smooth and very nice on the back so i was able to make it flush to the corbel which it made it um, look a lot more nicer once i hung it on the wall So here's the piece of wood that I cut down. I cut it to seven inches. I kind of think it's a little small. I should have probably cut it at eight to leave a little bit of room at the edge, but I'm still gonna use it. I wasn't too sure if I wanted to paint it white so it can match the corbels, but I really like the natural color of the wood. So I think I'm just gonna leave it. I did sand it down. It's just really nice and smooth. So I'm gonna leave this for now. I don't see myself painting it anytime soon. I just really like the way it looks. And I did think about probably putting something so it can be a little bit um, more sturdy, but I don't know. I haven't thought of anything of, or how to do it. So I'm just gonna leave it like that for now. But I was thinking of maybe putting another piece of wood on top of here and um, putting it like tight. I really don't want to put any nails or screws through my corbels. So I'm thinking of maybe putting um, something so it can make it stay on here. Um, like put pressure on it without actually having to um, make a hole into the corbels. been on my mind sick and tired of the nine to five in the city life hey darling we could get out of town see the beautiful world around wanna see it now pack our bags and get in that car real far let's get out we can leave this city let's drive to 
to the open air Yeah, the countryside is so pretty With the wind blowing in your hair We can look back someday Baby, don't you understand That we only get one life I wanna make it count, honey Come on now and take my hand oh, Hey, darling it's me and you On the road with a couple of tunes And a car for two Hey, darling You know we're gonna have a really good time Driving in the middle of the night When the stars are bright Pack our bags and get in that car real far Let's get out We can leave this city Let's drive to the open air Yeah, the countryside is so pretty With the wind blowing in your hair We can look back someday Baby, don't you understand That we only get one life I want to make it count Honey, come on now and take so pretty with the wind blowing in your hair we can look back someday baby don't you understand that we only get one life i wanna make it count honey come on now and take my hand yeah we only give one life i wanna make it count honey come on now and take my hand i just finished decorating this little area i think i'm gonna leave it like this because i really don't have any other decor to put up i still haven't brought in my fall decor i still have it in my shed but this is just stuff that i've recently purchased for fall so i'm just gonna leave it like that i love the way the mirrors look you guys but i'm so scared i'm relying on two command strips to hold down this mirror to <laughs> have it leaned into that other mirror I did put a um, nail, a screw on the top right here so it can hold the big one, but the small one, it's just with two command strips. So I'm really scared that it might fall. We already tried like slamming the door and everything to test it out and it seems to be secure, but you never know. I'm gonna cross my fingers on that, that it doesn't fall over because then I would, I would cry. <laughs> it's so pretty. I'm gonna show you guys around my home a little bit before I take down my patriotic decor. Full stop. Can't believe I live in your thoughts. I think about you all the time, morning, evening, and midnight. Such a wonderful delight. Everything that I own Yeah, I'd give it all up now Just to be with you somehow Unexpected love was found You're the rose in a garden And it shows if I'm 